Well, howdy, y'all. How you doing today? Welcome to Railroad Empire. It's me, your country boy, is on here, and I think we're going to play us a little game. I'm sorry for that. I had to do it. You guys know how much I like to live in the country. Stuff all this takes it to a whole new level. Welcome to Railroad Empire. And basically, this game is an old game that I kind of used to play. It was like Railroad, Sim Sid Meier's Empire, some something like that. It was way long ago where you would build tracks between towns, and you'd create trains, and they do routes and everything. And it was so much fun back then, and I love it. And someone either A, did a remaster of it, or B, they made their own game, and it's so much fun. Um, I've been playing it a little bit, and I thought, hey, I'd share it with you guys and, you know, show you what it's about. So let's get to it, shall we? I'm just going to do basically a free mode because I can. Um... Oh, shit, they added a whole new... Okay, I... You know what we're going to do, ladies and gentlemen? We are going to do America, and we're going to do 100 years because I can. And if you like the first video, hey, let me know, and I may continue it. Um, I doubt I'll get through the 100 years. That's number one. But, uh, oh, my God, we can build a whole thing. Where are you? I have no idea what city that is. Baker City. Uh, give me... Okay, I want to start up... Oh, where was that? That's Chicago. I don't want to start in Chicago. Um... Come on, where is that in Michigan? I know that's Michigan. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Give me it. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Come on. Uh, it's Toledo, Ohio. Really? Boo. No one wants to live in Toledo. Fuck Toledo. I'm kidding if anyone's from Toledo. You all have a nice state, and I guarantee you. But I like Michigan more. All right, fine. We can't start in Michigan. Um. Oh, fine. I guess we'll start in... Uh, we'll start in Pittsburgh. Why not? Big steel company. Sounds good. What, what created the railroad industry? All right, we're going to play in some realistic mode, pause mode. Uh, yeah. Now, everything will be normal and stuff, and, uh, you know what? We're going to... Oh, I have to start with a million. Okay. We're going to start with a million, which is the lowest setting I can do, because why the Your fuck not? Your is over. You found what you're looking for, partner. Did I really find what I'm looking for, partner? Because you sure as hell don't look like no cowboy. You look like the general. You gonna sell me car insurance? Don't ask questions about my business. The less you know, the better. I think the more I know, the better I'd be. All right, so we have the gangster. Sometimes I think about giving everything up and dedicating my life to poetry. How about you? Poetry, my friend. Yeah, fuck that shit. No. There's no way to halt the progress of technology. Oh my god, I forgot about this character. <laughs> fucking Doc Murphy. It's fucking Doc. Okay, yep. Yep, no. Okay, yep, 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 yep. Doc Brown. Okay, yeah, there we go. And uh, According to my calculations. Shut up, Brown. Time is highly important. I understand time's highly important. Shut up, I'm trying to think of a name for your company. Back to the rails, ladies and gentlemen. I totally clueless, these are was I saying? Did you just say they're nuclear? You shouldn't be playing with nuclear shit. All right. So let's just play the, with, with Doc Brown. God damn it. <laughs> I'm doing all of the memes. Marty, we have to go back to the future. Your kids, they're bad. Oh, uh, but yes, I, I used to play a game like this a long time ago that I absolutely loved to play. And it's just been so much fun. in this region, so it's not going to be easy. Don't waste any time and stick to your list of tasks. All right, I can do that. My list of tasks, speaking of which that I already saw, I'm going to get 60,000. Okay, okay. Transport 300 something out of grain, achieve annual profit. Okay, it's not bad. Deliver 70 loads of wood to Portland, Oregon. Hey, <laughs> hey, Flip, how you doing out there in Portland? I'm kidding. I don't think you live in there, but all right. Um, Okay. So we're, we, oh boy, we have already started not strong because they got ahead of me because I'm talking. Shit, okay. I need to build a station. Um, I'm going to build a large train station because this is my main capital and fuck it. We want a big station here. Okay, so first things first. I should probably do a line from Pittsburgh here to Toledo. We'll build that. Uh, train station. Give me a train station. Okay, that is one. That is one way. Uh, okay, we'll run. Give me you. Give me you. Okay. Oh, that's a double train station. What the fuck? Did I build a medium one? Fuck! I built a medium one. Damn it. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I can. I can work with this. All right. Yeah, yeah. I know I need to assemble a train, but first I need to do one thing. 
And this is in real life, ladies and gentlemen. If you didn't know, I, I finally figured out why trains have a, uh, have a double rail. It's so that one can go north and south and the other can go, or whatever direction you need, and the other one can go the other direction. It's like, what the fuck? How did I not figure that out already? But, um, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna set up the signals here. No, we're gonna set it up that way, and then we're gonna set the other signal that way. Okay. Supply tower, because in this game you do need to fill your uh, supplies with uh, stuff. And only the only reason I'm racing to get started is because I'm playing against three other AI, and they uh, they can really kill me real quick. All right, we're gonna set up a line here. We're gonna go from Pittsburgh to Toledo. Uh, you guys are gonna be passenger and mail only. We're gonna add this guy. Okay, there we go. And there we go. Now the cool thing about this game as well that uh, I like that I really do like is we can actually. Where is it? Right along with the train. Um, I wish it was a better camera view, don't get me wrong. But, you know, as you can see, we can do that. Oh, shit. I can't exit out of it. Exit out of it. But you can actually move the camera around, you can see, and, you know, it's pretty damn good animation, if I do say so myself, for a computer generated world. I really enjoy this. It's so much fun. Okay, whoops. Wrong button. Oh, and you can also toot the horn, obviously. <laughs> Okay, so we got that going. Uh, I'm also going to... Alright, you guys make beer. And I need to... You guys also make beer. Fuck. Okay, perfect. You both make beer. Alright, um... But you do buy... Do you buy wood? I need to know. Uh, let's go into the tab here. Do you buy wood? I forget. Uh, yes, you do buy wood. That is all I needed to know. Uh, so we are actually going to make... Oh, you also buy grain. That's right. Mm-hmm-hmm-hmm. <laughs> choices, choices, choices I have here. All right, we're going to build another railroad, actually. Going from the good old Pittsburgh to Indianapolis, where, hey, I will be... I will be very soon. I'm going to go see Jack Jacksepticeye play, actually, or perform there uh, soon, and it, As I see, it'll be a lot of fun. Set to expand further. Oh, fuck, I got Tweed Boy there. That'll be fun. Hey, Tweedy, shut up. I'm busy here running a railroad company, so fuck off, mate. I'm, I'm, I'm running this station over here. Get out of my way. Doug Brown is coming in to, from the future. He knows how all the railroads work. Hey, you be, you be losing your shit over this stuff. All right. So we're just going to run the train again like this and like that. And this is just so that when I do do this and set up trains, like multiple trains running uh, per line, it works a lot better in the workflow and stuff. So that's pretty good. All right. So we're going to throw a station down there in the middle. And luckily the signals cost me no money at all. So it makes up a lot, makes it a lot easier to play some and shit. Um... And obviously the different train stations load faster and not faster and stuff. And I'm just trying to make money as quick as I can basically right now. So we're also going to run another train. Okay. And again, we're going to, we're going to make this. Whoop. I fucked that up. Uh, you know what? Oh, yep. <laughs> Apparently I've already built over a thousand miles of track. Perfect. All right. Uh, I need to edit this route. I need to... Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Yeah, I needed to change it to passenger and mail only. All right, hopefully they didn't fuck up the route. Okay, good. No, it did not. So basically what we're trying to do is we're trying to create the biggest railroad company we can and do everything. And I get it. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. It, it does it faster and shit. We're good, we're good. And uh, all right, so sorry. Now that I've got my trains, let me explain what's going on here. Um, basically, you're building a company to take over the other companies that you can see here in order to buy it. And obviously I've got the most railroad, but apparently not the most stock. What the fuck? That doesn't make sense. I don't know. Either way, that's beside the point. Uh, but you're trying to buy out your competitors, basically. That's what you're trying to do. And then you can merge companies and stuff and get everything there. Then there's also research where you can research, you know, bigger locomotives, a whole, you know, and stuff like that for your, uh, for your trains. So right now I'm going to do this in order to get the, that, which increases my re reliability of my locomotives so that they don't break down. I have an express train. Oh shit. Okay, sweet. That's very cool. All right, so now we got that all settled. Now it's time to actually start making some import guys. And my God, do I have resources galore here. 
So because of that, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to build a large train station. Oh, can I do it? Come on, baby. Let me do it. Let me do it. Let me do it. Come on. Let me finagle this. Too little space for station. Oh, come on. There's plenty of space, baby. There's plenty of space. Fuck yeah. Okay, so we got everything there that can that can uh, be harvested there with the train, which is good. That's what we want. And now we're just going to attach this guy up to here. Now, this line is not going to be doubled because it'll just run one train in order to do that. So that'll be good. And honestly, for right now, that's fine. All right, so we're going to set that up. Um... I'm going to edit this to take wood as a higher priority right now because I don't need anything else. Because uh, this, this company doesn't buy that right now. Alright, and then... There we go. Now we're just going to add a locomotive, buy that there, and there we go! And again, the reason I... The reason I ran a, you know, wood train there is because as of right now over here... Wait. The fuck are you building a track up here for, you fucking bitch? Oh, this shit's mine. Get out of here. These companies are annoying me. Okay. So, what am I going to do next? Um, okay. Let's check my tasks first. Okay, so we're at, need to achieve an annual profit of 60,000 for passengers. We're working on that. Uh, we're achieving some annual profit from transporting mail. 400,000 people to my network. Okay, not a problem. Uh, transport some grain. So we need to transport... We need to start getting grain here. Yep, yep, I know. Higher quality goods we manufactured. That's fine. So the only grain station around here that I see is over there. Perfect. All right, so how am I going to do that? Is this grain? Oh, no, this is grain. Okay. Fuck me, then. All right. Um, 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 um. Well, actually, what we can do, so that we don't have to compete with that other place... Oh... Uh, yeah, of course I can. I can run a large station there, but... Ran out of money right now, so we're gonna fast forward time just a bit. Hopefully get some stuff going, and I kinda wanna actually get grain started over here. Um, I'm also gonna set up a new rail... Running over here, but I'm gonna run it with freight only. Then we're just gonna get that running. And he's going to just go there. Hopefully I didn't just spend money to spend money because I hope he's got some stuff that he can sell. Probably not, actually, now that I think about it. Uh, ooh. Power my locomotives? Fuck yeah. Give me that. I'll pay 30 grand. No, no, give me it. Give me, give me, give me. I want it. Come on, Doc Brown wants his, wants his technology. That's all he's about. He's always about the technology. He's always about pushing the envelope. Come on, Doc Brown. Fuck yes. Okay, I got that. I'm letting you go first on this journey into the unknown. Right, of course you are, my friend. Of course you are. So all I can say is fuck off. All right, um... Yeah, this will be good because this will get me people that I can put on trains to increase certain things. Is this train doing anything? No, it is not. Okay, so because of that, I'm going to... Uh, just do automatic so he actually starts loading stuff up. There we go. So I'm running passengers right now like crazy. That's fine, but I need to diversify my goods. I need to diversify the goods. Um, so what we're going to do now is we're going to create a small train station. I'm just going to run grain uh, to the one outpost here in Toledo. So that I can start getting... Uh, Diversified goods. And I can't build it because I need 39 grand, so a train, please, please uh, give me some money. And as you can see now, I've got two trains running, so hopefully that'll give me two that. All right, so we have a headhunter. What do you do again? Poaches an employee from one of your competitors. <laughs> like to see a look on their face if I do that. Uh, but I don't want to spend 20 grand on you right now. Oh, here we go. Now I can get a better locomotive. I hope that this locomotive is a success. It will be a success. Uh, railroad company. Ra Fuck the John Hancock. Mm -hmm. Let me, let me take, let me take my John Bull out and, uh, yeah, it's going to cost me five grand. That's fine. I'll do that. Going to upgrade all my trains to the John Bull because it's a mixed freight train and it'll be fine. Yep. The John Bull. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. <laughs> She's steaming her way across, but I gotta look up John Bull. 
Oh, there's the John Hancock right there. That's why. Okay, but I got the John Bull, which is better. Okay, so they they just saved their points. That's fine. All right, so back where I was. All right, I need to build this railway line. That's number one. Um, number two. Ooh, Stoker, perfect. All right, uh, I'll show you guys what they do there. All right, so we're going to run him to here. Check. We're going to add a locomotive. We're going to buy another John Bull. And the Stoker basically is going to increase the reliability of my train by 20%. Damn. It's not bad. Oh, no. Come on. My reporter took a close look at your small business. Oh, I don't like you, bitch. You're going down. Oh, I really don't like him. <laughs> I really don't, especially considering most of my business runs on people right now. That's not a good thing for me. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know, but uh, that's fine. All right, so this is a caution of that. Um, what I would like to get is definitely that because I'm going to get more profits, but I need 300 innovation points. It's almost not worth it right now to do that, so we're going to let that ride for right now. Okay, so Pittsburgh, we are almost literally transferring everything out of you by mail. That's fine. So what we're going to do actually is we're going to we're going to go to New York, New York because they actually oh, they have a thing that I need. Um New York has, as you can see, they have meat. And the meat will be provided by there, and then I can sell that meat over to here, and then I can sell the beer over to there, and we make money. That's what we'd like. We make the money. Now, the only problem is I have to go over a very large expanse, because they don't want to... Because if you look, you can see uh, on the side there, it's gonna. it tells me how much everything's going to cost. And if you build like a straight rail, it's going to cost you more, but it will be a straighter shot. Don't get me wrong. Like, see, it's going to cost me over, oh, God, it's going to cost me over 200 and some odd grant to, yeah, to do that. So we're going to just see if I can make the price a little cheaper. Yeah, I can do it for about one. Okay, so we're going to have to wait on that price, but New York's going to do that. So for right now, actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to close that. Actually, I'm going to destroy that plan, and I'm going to run uh, beef products straight to here for right now. For when I can, uh, oh, what you call it? When I can run it to the um, the one station out there in Pittsburgh, because Pittsburgh need their meat. There we go. All right. So actually, I cannot afford a train right now. So fuck. All right. That's fine. We'll speed up time for right now and get get some more profits, get some more innovation points in order to build shit and just keep on going. Because that's what it's all made about. Ooh, reporter. Um, I actually might buy you. Uh, oh, fuck yeah, I'm gonna hire that. Um, uh, basically, she's gonna reduce the price of by 50%. Um, Roger Smythe, you're the one, you're the asshole that did that to me. Hey, enjoy it for yourself as well. <laughs> this is getting better and better. Can I expect negative press now? Ha <laughs> ha! Yes, yes, you can, bitch. That's what you did to me. So fuck you, senor. Fuck you. Okay, so actually now they do take sugar. Which I have a sugar mine there, which is good. So now I need to create... Uh, Where's that one route? Bad condition. <gasps> fuck, I forgot to build one thing. Uh, I forgot to build a repair station. Fancy little game. That's my bad. That's my bad. I forgot to build that. So Was that your wheel that just rolled towards me? Yeah, yeah, I get it, you asshole. Stop it. Oh, this new locomotive looks impressive. Yes, it does, and it will be on the rails in half a second. Just give me a second. God damn. Ugh. This is what happens in this game. You speed it up, and all of a sudden, everything goes to shit. Yep, there we go. All right. And we're going to buy the North America. And we're going to buy a security guard, too, because that'll actually... Uh, what they do is they'll protect it from uh, bandits and attacks, but they also increase the freight by 5% on the uh, on the route, so that's actually a good route for there. Um, okay. Yeah, express line, express line, that's kind of what I want to do now. So we are going to manage the train. We're actually going to upgrade again, but I can't buy it because you need 34 grand, which you don't really need because you're not going to spend that much, so I don't get it why I can't do that shit. Yeah, I know, I know. Position stop signals, blah, 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 blah. Exa I get it, I get it. All right. 
So as you can see, actually, we have the most cities connected, except for New York. We don't speak about New York right now, uh, by our trains. So it's not too bad. Okay, so we got enough money now. I should be able to upgrade a bunch of my trains. All right, but I got to update you. And this is still mixed, so actually we can do it for all. Like, see, I only paid a grand for that train. I'm going to pay, you know, two grand for that train. Uh, I, gotta, oh, I paid six grand for that train. That's an older train, I guess. I just, that's the, that's already the North America, so that's fine. Here's my other John Bull. I see, I paid two grand for that. And I believe that is it. Yep, there we go. We got all North Americans. Uh, I do need to add a station over here because... <laughs> and we set a new land record of 25 miles an hour. I know people like can run faster than that. Jesus that Christ. That is a real record. There's no denying it. Mm-hmm. Yes, it is, sir. So fuck off. <laughs> Get out of my face. Why you pop up like that? I, I Don't come over to your business and say, Hey, fucker, how you doing? Ooh, that looks nice. Why don't I just jack that off? Why don't I? Jesus. Mm. Idiots. All right. Um... Oh my god, I am so manic right now, just trying to get everything done. Oh, but first, I do need to build a a maintenance shed over here because I have one train that runs from here to there, and it can't get maintenance, so we need to do that. And I kind of screwed that up in the beginning of the game, so no, I'm fixing it, because I have to. <laughs> Otherwise, it's a bad problem. Okay, so they're running. They're making about five grand a load, which is good. It's really, really good. Let's see here. Oh, I don't have enough money for that. Fuck it. Like, see, it's already at five... Five hundred. Uh, fuck it, I'll swing it. Go ahead, I'll swing it. If he bids more, I'm out, but we'll see. I might get it for a little bit of a price. Keep ahead of the competition, one might say. Will your books still balance after the auction? Well, yes, they will, so shut up. <laughs> All right, so we're going to just get the central shaft here so that my uh, tunnels will cost me less money in order to do so. Right now, we got New York. All right. Oh, my God. He's making me 16 grand doing that for New York. Oh, shit, man. That's good. That's real good. All right, so now comes my situation here where I'm going to try and build. Actually, what I'm actually going to do first is upgrade... I need to construct a maintenance shit over here. That's first of all, but number one. But I'm going to expand the station out here first and then create a double line going from here to here. That way I can run passengers as well and stuff. And But the problem is I've got to run through these mountainous areas. So that's going to be a little interesting. Like I could cut through there like I wanted. Oof. It's not good. Or I could try running it down to Washington. By security. This is all this game is is managing like people and shit and trying to get everyone everywhere. All right, so I'm gonna slow down the game for a second. Okay, we're gonna manage the train. <gasps> Forgot to put a supply tower. Shit. God bless, I'm an idiot. Okay, hold on. This doesn't have a supply tower. That has a supply tower. That route has a supply tower. This route doesn't. Okay, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> oh my god, I'm an idiot. Jesus Christ. Okay, let's pause for a second and think. I need to connect this route to this thing in order to do that, and then I can get access to all this stuff. But in order to do that first, I need to upgrade this route, or this train station, to number two, which I can do that now. Then I need to plan out my route. All right, let's see. How much would it cost for me to go through the mountain? Oh my god. That is the shortest and most cheapest, or not cheapest, but definitely the shortest route to do that. There is no fucking way I can afford that right now. So we're going to trash that route. Oh, oh god. Oh, okay. Um, so we're going to run it. Try and run it this way. Yeah, I'm going to have to take down a bunch of that shit. That's fine. Okay, and then we'll run her like so. On the Great Plains of the USA. No, I'm not even in the Great Plains. All right, and then we're going to run her right up to there. And actually, I save about 20 grand, so not too bad there. All right, that's fine. All right, so now I just need to save my money. 
Okay, I should be able to do that, but I think that's where we're going to call it for this episode. I hope you like this one. I hope you like this game with Railway Empire. I absolutely love this game, and as you can see, it's a little maniac, so, you know, who knows how this is going to go. You know, I thoroughly enjoy it, and, you know, let's hope uh, Back to the Rails survives this, and I don't get bought out by a company, but we'll see. So, thank you, ladies. Thank you. God, I can't even do my intro right, or outro right. Jesus Christ, I'm, I'm a mess tonight. All right, but anyway, thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for watching, and as always... Enjoy the show.